Hi everybody, today we're gonna uh, find out where is a short on a VDD boost on iPhone 7. As you know VDD boost uh, take, takes power from the VCC main and boosts it up so uh, it goes to almost all the ICs that VCC used to go to or supply uh, voltage to. Um, here trying to see where the fault is by injecting current uh, to the caps of the VDD boost circuit. Because as you can see now, uh, uh, it kind of just goes everywhere. <laughs> Or you'll see it maybe in the next shot you'll see it uh, heating up just the cap where I inject the current as a solid short because it took around two and a half to three amps um, at this point I did not do a full visual inspection which I should have but I approached it differently so I now after trying so so hard to find out where the short was I decided to remove uh, VDD boost IC U2301 and then inject current and maybe mm, that would find out where the short was uh, yeah I think here I'm, I'm trying to remove the IC now The main purpose of this IC is to raise the voltage uh, to uh, close to 4 volts even if the battery voltage is down. Did not have it in 6S and the previous older generation iPhones. Just applying some heat and then add flux. To help in the removal of the IC.
it takes considerable amount of heat to to remove the ICs on the iPhone 7. Uh, usually uh, add extra flux that helps in the removal process dissipates the heat more evenly the reason I removed it is to, to concentrate the injected current on the downstream of the VDD boost IC because uh, when I was injecting current uh, the IC also was heating up so I removed it to help me in locating the source of the short now yeah, this is the overhead cam shot of the same video clip that you saw now I connected to uh, DC DC power supply uh, just hook up the ground clip and inject the current using a probe I don't solder down uh, a wire to the VDD boost circuit you just uh, inject the current with a probe at this point I'm just checking for the boost uh, diode mode and verifying whether if the short is on VDD boost or not Since there was a, a solid short, I decided here to inject the current uh, using freeze spray to detect, detect the source of the short, but it was inconclusive. I start to increase the voltage gradually but even that did not help loca to locate the source of the short at this point I decide decided to remove the IC As usual, uh, you shield the area to prevent heat to the other uh, ICs on the circ on the board.
add some more flux and then apply heat again with iPhone 7 I've noticed that I need to add flux, flux twice and then it starts uh, starts it up uh, and uh, becomes easier to remove Yeah, I see has been removed. There's no corrosion, nothing under it. And this phone uh, had no um, uh, marks, or water leakage marks, or uh, as you can see from the simple diagram, uh, VD boost goes to the LDO back camera, back camera LDO. And next to it, there's a capacitor that is corroded, which is weird because uh, there were no water marks or any source of liquid damage. But it was from a cracked camera lens um, that vapor, water vapor, leaked inside and shorted it. I replaced the cap and uh, cleared the fault.